Kwa mtu wa matatu, pei ya mafuta yuko juu, uwezi pata pesa, kwa sababu naenda kwa mafuta, wanaweka pesa mingi, kwa mbea dinafire wanapata mafuta, kwa mbea dinawakati stima, higa liya stima ikikoja, tutapata. Tapata pesa mingi, na mwenye gali pia tapata pesa mingi. Gali ya mafuta, Especially wale watu wako na magonjwa kama asthma na kifua inaleta madhara ya magonjwa. Sasa hii gari ya stima ikikuja at least magonjwa itapungua. So not only do these products offer us the possibility of reducing greenhouse gas emissions, it also offers us the possibility of becoming fuel independent, where we don't have to look at the cost of fuel every morning as we wake up, but we can actually drive vehicles um, that, that reduces our cost of operating so much that Kenya as a country and us as individuals become independent of oil prices, and uh, both on the emission side and uh, for our wallets. That's why we offer zero emission vehicles, right? Because those products, putting those products to the market, and that's what this fundraise is helping us to do, will mean that we can reduce Kenya's emissions and East Africa's emissions towards the targets that has been put, put there by the Kenyan government and what we need to reach as a global community. remove the internal combustion engine, we uh, replace that with an electric motor, and then we put a battery pack and a control unit to it, which means that suddenly we no longer have to go to the petrol station to fill our buses or our vehicles with petrol or diesel and then drive on it, but we can go to an, an electrical outlet, plug in our vehicle, just the same way we charge our, uh, charge our cell phones.
Uh, the transport system in Kenya, for instance, that in Nairobi, is blend for most of the pollution. And OP bus bringing on board an electric bus, I think this is something that uh, we all need to celebrate. And I'm hoping that OP bus is going to accelerate the, this transition so that uh, it comes uh, very fast for us. Uh, and also just to ensure that uh, we have a clean environment, a quiet city and a very efficient system of uh, transport. Climate change is a very devastating effect that you're having currently as a continent. Oh, it's it is saddening that Africa has not been part of causing the effect of this climate change, yet it's the most vulnerable. But we do not, we, we just don't sit and wait for action to be taken. We have decided to take action and we are coming up with technologies that are helping us uh, conserve our environment as well as reduce the impacts of that climate change and this is a message to the whole world this is a message to the globe and uh, other other countries outside uh, in africa and um, just to take action as well in their technologies in what they do to ensure that they are able to curb the emissions and also reduce the impacts of climate change